been a while since I played this one. Yeah. Pretty sure I've got the whole game still memorized, though. You can talk like Star Fox really easily, too. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Blah, 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 blah. Hey, did you know that you can move this around at the tile screen? And they watch it. It's crazy. Yeah, maybe you didn't Slippy know that. freaks out like the little gimp <laughs> bitch he is. He's got, like, wide-eyed crack eyes or something. Okay, there's a plot. Do you care? No. Go on no. Out. Even though it's fully voiced. <laughs> Go to the planet that was the Independence Day knockoff. It's about okay. time you showed up, Fox. Fox! You're the only hope for our world. I'll do my best. Andros won't have his way That's with the me. the Republican Party saying, Thank you, Fox. You're the only hope for our world. <laughs> Topical! <laughs> I think this game is basically made to... Like, make the PlayStation bomb look so cool. We could do 3D too, see? Well, the Nintendo 64 did 3D a whole lot better than the PlayStation, but they didn't have, you know, FMVs or voice acting. They just made a game with a bunch of these full motion cutscenes and voice acting. Check your heat diffuser system. Horrible dialogue. Falco here. I'm fine. <laughs> All systems go. Slippy here. I'm okay. Why does Slippy sound like a girl? Gender issues. Uh, why do you insist on slouching so far away from the microphone? I, I realize you have an excellent slouching technique and you should show it off when it's possible. How does your spine not look like a little movie script here. after sitting like that? Slippy, watch out! Bogey on your tail! Oh god, Slippy. Whoa! Help me! Can't shake him! Thanks, Fox! I thought they had me. You should've. Watch out for those laser shooting teacups. <laughs> Detroit Cordia City. There's a trick you can do in this game where you fire Everybody stay alert. shots like this at a target and you get extra points. And that's how you get the highest scores possible. I don't play like that though. That's not how you roll. I don't play by your rules. I always thought I do this for no reason. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, you just bounce off of that robot? Yeah, got my way. <laughs> Should've known better. Is it, yeah, that's the other thing you can do. You can bounce your wings off to become tiny and then, like, get healed up again. I'll take this. Yeah. Get the one behind me. Not much point in doing it, though. Something's wrong with the Whoops. Oh, well, there you go. Whatever. Use the boost <laughs> I guess I should be thanked. <laughs> I shot a bomb at him. <laughs> you guessed right. There you go. Yeah. That's his stuff. Do a barrel roll! <laughs> <laughs> you familiar with that from you, Dad? Familiar with uh, <laughs> You're a crazy bastard. <laughs> this is how you play the game right here. <laughs> <laughs> Those are like, like tank versions of those things. Yep. That's what this game is. Like <laughs> that is not flying! I fly good. Don't tell me how to fly. He's gonna rock on the desk. I've got the target. Try to keep up. You're not really flying so much as just controlling the fall. It's <laughs> <laughs> falling with style. Ah, uh, you got the reference. <laughs> I like it's an unknown movie. <laughs> Why are you so bad at it? <laughs> Ground A! It doesn't even matter, it's the first level. You can do what I want. <laughs> I can do what I want when I want. Who's uh, Someone won. Oh, for Emperor here. In the words of my generation. Up, yours! Yours! 
I want the shockwaves. Alright, you're part of an elite team. We're going to give you millions of, um, billions of dollars of technology in this one elite fighter squad. What are you going to do with it? I'm going to shoot laser blasts at the water! <laughs> Look at them waves! <laughs> Stay All here our hopes depend on you. If I'm in the cockpit, I can fly into mountains! <laughs> this is a prototype shield system. With it, you can survive impacts that normal carriers and fighters would not be able to sustain. That means I can fly into a building! <laughs> Playing this game is the right choice. <laughs> it explodes in a sphere of purple. Accomplished! All aircraft report. You did it! I was worried for a moment. You're becoming more like your father. I touched, <laughs> I touched a little bit of His father's in a okay there, mental institution right now, so that makes sense. <laughs> They don't survive the mission and they don't chime in and you feel very, really, really bad about yourself. For some strange reason. His father is Davy Crockett's hat. <laughs> don't wear my father as a hat. <laughs> okay. Alright. If my destination is uh, a little down the road, Independence Day easy. Planet, then I can go to a place with Japanese robots or a place with flying rocks. Well. Animal! My name is Sector oh, Y, and I'm an anime! Help us out here! I'm on my way! My name is Sector Y, and I'm a chromosome! <laughs> oh, this level's awesome. Yeah. Zakus! Pretty much. Zig Zeon. Mm. Mm -hmm. I'm a fan of the Mange Gundam series. Yeah. Name three. So you're not a fan? Uh, Gundam hey 00, there's Gundam 0079, uh, two others. Gundam... <laughs> this is where it gets tricky. Gundam 8th Units, and I think there's Gundam 0083. Yeah. There's Gundam, okay. Yeah, there's the Venus universe, I think. Gundam Venus and Venus. It was Gundam Venus and Venus for a while. <laughs> <laughs> sure how that... I shot the lasers out of her, and then I took the lasers. Oh, are you talking about penis? <laughs> penis? <laughs> uh, you're talking about that your parents, or Surprise, maybe a teacher at school, bomb. medical practitioner. Oh, I missed with the bomb so bad. Hold them, they're trying to get through! Put a, like, picture putting a pencil in a Death pencil Death Star Trench! <laughs> it's like that. It's really putting a pencil into a hole in a you're supposed to shoot them all. Uh, Excuse me for not doing all the work. Excuse me, wow. Falco. <laughs> I dismissed everything. They came from behind. The gamma settings, I can't see crap anyway. Oh, I hit that guy. Come on. We can see pretty well on this big board. I, I cranked up my gamma settings too. Which are epsilon <laughs> Alpha settings? <laughs> I'm going up this time. No! I've got everything above. Ah, you're supposed to go up, it's better. Fly up, stupid. Yeah, here we go. Blue lasers. You can press the button even more, more things happen. It's awesome. <laughs> Just bomb it, <laughs> every surface of the cockpit. <laughs> I 
I got one in my sights. Great kid, don't get cocky. <laughs> Supplies! <laughs> Something's up ahead. Looks different. So are all the animals on Star Fox Planet Central? Um, I think they come from different planets. They're really big on like keeping planets consistent and stuff like that. They don't really do that. Enemy shield analyzed. I'm just wondering if all the animals are sentient because Star Fox has a carnival. Humans! <laughs> I'm taking damage! So this is a pathetically easy boss. Good job! Keep up the good work! It's cool because it's a free run. He's almost dead. There we go. Uh oh. Oh no! See, they're not really doing it the Japanese way. You're supposed to have the two little robots to join together to form one big robot. I form the head. Or alternatively, you can have fly to the spaceship. That's good too. <laughs> That's a brilliant Couldn't you have the smaller robot that unexpectedly turns into a bigger robot, ignoring your conservation pattern? That's good too. Is that it? You can also have the smaller robots transform onto the bigger robot. What about the Ring Galaxy Chat? Oh yeah, definitely. See, oh, it's an option. Slippy hit! <laughs> Slippy talks to the third person! Slippy's disturbingly androgynous! Gee, quit moving around! You know, some frogs can change sex. Only other things you want from Jurassic Park. Ah, <laughs> finally he's gonna slow down his ships are gonna shoot at him. Shot lasers at him. <laughs> uh, my 15 year old self would be so disappointed with me right now. <laughs> used to be the master of this game. Oh, I think if I can view my 15 year old self, the first thing I do is punch him in the face. <laughs> yeah. yeah, me too. Yeah. I saw that guy. It's in the face. Everything's a okay. It's like, hey, me, how's it going? Well, you know, not too bad. You worry about Two your things. Own Invest in Google. Kabam! <laughs> <laughs> I probably grab myself by the shoulders and shake really hard and say, do something else in high school besides play StarCraft. <laughs> <laughs> I don't. I have a no comment idea. on video. Games. <laughs> <laughs> if I was gonna give myself advice on what to do in life, I don't know. I'm kind of at a loss. <laughs> yeah, so I didn't take the good paths and kill all the guys in that level. So I don't get the option of going to the harder level, which is crap anyway. Is the enemy. Will you help him out? If you yep. do. Yeah. Affirmative, General. Screw you guys. I'm going home. Aren't you guys like a mercenary team anyway? Aren't you making like yep. big cash money for this? Much money for this? Mm hmm. The team is getting paid on, guys. Help do, do, is on do, do, the way. Well, it's kind of like, um, it's the same way Samus Aran is a mercenary. Or a bounty hunter or whatever. So you're like, you're the black water of this game? <laughs> okay, so the guys in the black ships are evil. And these guys are the good guys. Whoa! I shoot all of them. I do not discriminate. It's just like Vietnam all over again. Star Fox is in the trees, 
become quite a enemy mothership approaching. Oh, he shut your mouth. I just shot, I shot at him, but it cut off the comment because the mother mothership is approaching. Shoot him some more. Enemy down! Wait, that was one of ours! <laughs> there he is. Let me just see if I help you again. <laughs> yeah, man. You got some yeah, killer I'm waves. Fine. I'm on your side. How do they know about Einstein, crazy, wacky, animal-talking world? <laughs> That's the question of so our time. There, there was a sentient sheep that also happened in the same way. You also in the bank. Crazy, wacky, animal world. It's a landing no, it's platform for UFOs! <laughs> Ziggurat, turn into mushroom! Insert Stargate joke. <laughs> I want Independence Day. Yeah, it's this is really cool. Independence Day. It's a good combination. Not bad. Independence Day and Stargate? That means Will Smith going through the Stargate. Oh, hell no! Not these Jafar, yeah? Oh, yeah, you are not shooting... You are not shooting those zats at me. You are not shooting those zats at me. So much <laughs> <laughs> the hatches are open. All units report. Getting shot at by Fox. <laughs> Dead. Surprise! They did good, do a good job just bombarding this entire level with enemies, though. I mean, there's just stuff everywhere. It's awesome. The hatches are open! Is that What? Wink, wink. <laughs> See if I help you again. Why the hell did not get made in this game on the Wii yet? The hatches are open! Independence Day PlayStation game? That was horrible. Yes. Well, because I remember playing it at Toys R Us. Well, if you remember correctly, Star Fox is co opted by the Furries. That happened on the GameCube, and it was a disgrace. Yeah. Well, first the game, they gave the, se the series to Rare. Oh, and they made Star Fox Adventures, and it was horrible. The hatches are open! And they basically used like the design of the old N64 game and made it in Star Fox, and it was just crap. Hey, we have a great franchise based on a uh, 3D rail shooter. What are we gonna do with it? I know! 3D roaming adventure game! Brilliant! Pretty much. And then afterwards, Nintendo actually took this franchise back. Gave it to Namco instead. You don't get to use this anymore. <laughs> I'm taking my franchise and going home. <laughs> Proving that you're not responsible. And Namco started developing a Star Fox uh, arcade game, actually. It's gonna be like an arcade game and a home game. They would like be based on each other, sort of. Hey, Peppy, how's it going? Fly right through, and that's cool. Cool. You know, there's actually like a Mario Kart arcade game. Yeah, made by Namco. They put Pac-Man everywhere. It's like they had a big bucket full of Pac-Man and <laughs> spilled it all over the <laughs> game. <laughs> uh, I guess I better. Show. <laughs> Everyone make this noise at the same time. Go. <laughs> As you're walking by, you slip on it. And it goes. <laughs> 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 and you slip on it and fall down on your back, and like the public Pac-Man, they all start eating you. <laughs> <laughs> Get him off! Get him. It's just a skeleton. It's like that scene from Indiana Jones 4. <laughs> and it's just. <laughs> You too, Bill. There's unspoken tension going on there. <laughs> oh, if uh, if you do well on this level and none of the good allies die, they'll fly in formation with you. <laughs> that didn't really happen. <laughs> the skies are empty. And I get a medal. Because that was so awesome there. And now I have the option of flying into the sun. Cool. That's my reward. My reward. But, uh, Icarus. screws that, we're going to Sector X. Been to Sector X and Sector Y. You know what that means. Reports indicate that Andros <laughs> is working on some secret weapon. What if he goes to Sector Z? I'll check it out. 
you're... Yeah, so... You've got... It means you can move in the vertical. 